Hello everybody, this is your favorite monarch. Today we're doing some of a little uh, we're doing something that's a little, a little bit unique. Last time I played a video game with a controller. It was Darza's Dominion. And basically if you guys had watched that video, all I was really doing was preparing myself for when I finally did this. So this is episode one of the controller player experience. I did a poll a while ago. We're going to hold on to my old shield as a luck item. That's just how it is. But um, I did a poll on what pet I should use because I have two different pets. I have one for like my regular PPEs and a one for, um, you know, just regular gameplay, which um, is my divine pet here, 100-189. And uh, it would end it on a tie, uh, if I remember correctly. So I just went with my divine pet, mostly because I have one. I haven't played Realm in ages. Two, um, I'm already at a big enough handicap because I'm playing with a controller. Oh right, I forgot to show. I forgot to give you guys this. Bam! I'm glad I realized that. Uh, I didn't do anything on this character besides give it some red dyes. Uh, I know my character is normally green. But uh, maybe we'll change it. Maybe we'll we'll spice it up every episode. I might change them. Who knows? We'll see what y'all want like. So I only have keybinds for my top four right here. Um, I all of my all the controls are from uh my Darz's video. Um, I I will get a a screen cap or something for you guys to see that. But basically. We are, we're just going to play this like a regular character, well, regular PPE. Only difference is I have a whole controller and I'm, I, I don't know if I'm going to be editing these too much or just cutting out the boring stuff. Hopefully you all enjoy this because I know I probably will. I, I will just, uh, I don't have a keybind for control. So, I'm just going to go ahead and use my mouse for that. <laughs> I don't remember what my nexus button is. That might be a problem. I think it's O. It is O. We figured that out. <laughs> um, if you were curious as to when I was recording this, it is 5 a.m. Uh, so I don't really know what will be happening, uh, player count wise. Probably nothing, really. Because every everyone tends to group up in the same server anyways, so. Like, I was trying to get in the e US East before I, uh, started recording. I think I'm just permaloading now, thank you, Decca. Realm of the Mad God is a game with zero flaws, guys. <laughs> You'd think uh, with how long Exult's been out, what, like, I think... It's been three or four years. You'd think with how long Exult's been out, they'd have fixed some of the permaloading problems. And I, they probably have, but being DECA, they tend to do some pretty interesting things. And by uh, interesting things, I mean whatever is going on right here. And no one should be spending $42 on an entrance, of all things. There's skins half that price that are better. There we go. Oh, beer god. That's not where I want to be. Or maybe it is. I think I did the Darz's video back in December, right? When the update came out. Yeah, so it's been a hot minute. I'll take the katana. I know this is a night PPE, but... Oh, I didn't get anything. Alright, well... I didn't actually... I didn't see what the things for this was. Those are okay. Alright, Frove and uh, From Above. 
It's time to get me a shiny Rezu. I don't actually know if those drop yet. But, uh, it's time to get me one. I actually... I don't think I've ever gotten a Rezu. Yeah, no. I think I got one, and it was just because of Forge. So that's actually kind of insane. Then again, who does Cemetery? Oh, shit. We also got Vazo. Uh, Vazgek. I don't... I'm not even going to try to. We got Vazo. This is like the dream team. Minus me. This is the dream team for doing cemeteries. And I'm the, uh... I'm the one getting carried. Oh, hey. Everyone loves a good upgrade. I can actually do stuff now for the team. Well, I, I think I've actually been able to do some a decent bit of damage with the fire sword, but... This is the this is one of the few places where you can hear the classic realm theme. Which is depressing because this place sucks. I think what Deca needs to do next, after the realm rework, is like a nostalgia dungeon or something. Which I, I guess is technically what the um I didn't realize that was also a Nexus body. <laughs> but, um, what I was saying was, I think that's also technically what, um, the uh, battle for the Nexus is at this point. Because that's, that's still got old Stethno and, uh, the other guy, right? Or old Stethno, uh, Green Dragon, and O2. It's got old all of them, right? I don't remember the last time I've done a battle for the Nexus. Those dungeons are so rare to come across. I'm so glad I remembered that, um... You know, I was... I, I had an entire thing just to show you guys my controller. No, I'm not turning Crucible on. We need that. We do, we do these. We do these. I haven't done a Candyland in ages. Well, I... I say that, but I haven't played this game in ages. Last time I did was when I did the uh, chest video a couple weeks back, and even then that video didn't come out for a week after it, so. Or I think it didn't, at least. I'm gonna miss it completely. I fell for it. I'm a fool. Smite me. Get chain stunned? Nothing? Alright, let's give me a defense. I know you want to give me one. If I can hit a single shot for Soulbound? Oh, hey. We, we take those. Candy ring? We got some cringe? We're gonna see if I can max one stat before this video ends. Let's see what my roll is. Oh, right. The St. Patrick's event is going on. I want to play more realms so I can get it, or get the um, coins for the luck title, but at the same time, I'd have to play realm by myself, because I think like none of my friends want to play it, which is uh, fair. I really can't blame them. Yeah, once we get rid of we can get out of here. Oh, I have auto fire as one of my keybinds. Okay. Interesting. There's Roto. He is not gonna last that long. I guess as everyone's gonna leave after Cupcake. Ooh. All right, our first dungeon alone. Unless someone shows up. Lyman, what's up? I cannot wait for the realm rework. I think that's what's gonna get 
everything back in order. Although, you know, nothing's gonna stop Deca from doing more really lame cosmetics that are 50 bucks. Isn't that the April Fool's sprite for Davy or um for the Ghost Chef? Why is he out right now? We don't have April Fools for another two weeks as of recording this. I don't actually know when this video will get posted. I have like a dozen things that I need to edit. This Davy's gonna get me everything that I'm gonna need. And by that I mean a uh, swashbuckler, the coat, a uh, captain's ring. I don't think it drops a shield. Mithril shield. Whole set, one bag. Doesn't it, the coat doesn't even drop from Davy, but I'm gonna get it in one bag. That's the wrong armor, but uh, I'll take it. Colorful adventure. Damn. I'm gonna do one of these. Oh, he said the line. Straight link or stringless dot Lord of the Lost Lands death. But also that means I lost miss Lord of the Lost Lands. Uh I'm a necromancer. Dude, do you guys remember the necromancer UPE? That guy is still alive. I just haven't like recorded clips for him. Or played him, actually. Or well I haven't played him since that video came out. I think he's my longest living character next to my other knight. Or my main knight. Before that was my paladin. And then uh, it tragically died. Uh, I'll probably make an entire video about that. I'm built different. And by that I mean I'm playing knight. Man, I am so behind the times. I have no idea what ha what this thingy is. Like, you stop paying attention to Realm for five minutes, and suddenly there's 18 new best-in-slot items for one class, and none of the other ones. It's weird. Which is fair, because every melee just gets, you know... Um, divinity. 20 more decks. We are moving up fast. Everyone's on here. I, I, st I, I'm still not gonna be here. Jeez. Cemetery. Ooh, boss give more loot. I think that's only Skull, though, isn't it? If anyone was curious about the Construction Night Bros uh, PPE series, uh, that's not being done again for a while. Mostly because uh, Jonah decided to continue playing it after we recorded and died. I remember when I was younger, me and my brother would only like farm sums because they were like, dude, you could get four boss or you get four bosses and each of them have a chance of dropping a mithril shield. And I was just like, dude. Hell yeah. I remember uh, I lost my knight that was like 5'8 or something. Max defense, so it was devastating back then. Because, you know, you're, um, you're like 12, just getting into the game after... Or, and just like finally maxing a character after like two years. Or something. I think that's like how long it was. Um, and you lose your 5'8 full of uh, what's the one before top I can't or I can't remember what they called it but uh you'd get you'd have your full abyssal sky splitter mithril shield eggs HP you get that full set and a 5 8 night you're basically invincible until um you're not and uh, my brother he drew a he drew a thing on my 
desk that was just like, dude, if you come play Re Realm with me again, I could give you a Mithril Shield or a uh, Abyssal, uh, your choice. <laughs> And uh, I ended up just not taking either because I didn't play the game again for another like three months. That's the nice thing about, you know, deck of getting ownership of Realm is the fact that the moment that they added like daily rewards and all that so that, you know, you could actually make progress. Um, that was great. Got one of these. Oh, yeah. But uh, the moment that they added the daily or uh, daily quest and you just had to get on, grab your... Um... Grab your character slot, your bolt slot, and then bam. That was amazing. Because, you know, back then, chances are uh, you weren't allowed to spend money on microtransactions in video games. Or at least we weren't. Which uh, makes sense. Because uh, microtransactions, for the most part, tend to just be the dumbest things imaginable. And generally are just not anything that's worth it. But with Realm of the Mad God, that tied into basically, like, your entire progression. And it's just like, or yeah, uh, Kabam era, it, it tied into your entire progression, because it's just like, you start, there's no way to get a character slot, there's no way to get a vault slot. Um, and if you died, um, you died. You only had enough room in your vault ever for, like, a, an extra set and a couple of UTs. And everything else was either getting fed to your pet or uh, left on the ground. Because, you know, back then you also couldn't trade anything that wasn't tiered. Um, I, 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 I played Realm in the era, or, like, I played Realm... I think a little bit after they removed being able to trade UTs. I, I'm pretty sure. But, um... it's This has been a game that's just, like, great to watch kind of grow and all of that. But at the same time... Um... I'm not really sure where I'm going with this. Uh, at the same time, it's just like, oh, hey, Realm of the Mad God. Um, I love everything that's going on here. Daka just tends to be a little bit of a problem. At least with uh, when it comes to communication. And... Or maybe they communicate well, but as far as I've seen, um, it's questionable. Like with the the ticket system, but um, Deca is questionable at without their pricing scheme. Like like I said earlier when I was I showed you all it. Who in their right mind is spending forty dollars on an entrance, which you're only going to see literally whenever you enter a dungeon or nexus. That's literally it. Like, no one's going to be paying attention to that. It's it's just going to be like, wow. that Look at that guy. He spent $42 on a rainbow that appears when he spawns it. <laughs> Let's laugh at him. <laughs> but, I mean, that that's just my way of thinking about it. Thank God for Divine, right? I don't know what I'd do without it. Uh, besides get better. Hey, an attack.
Ow, can I stop taking damage so I can perma stun? Zero. Huh. So what are we at? Two attack left. Seventeen decks? No, six turn. No way! We got our first white bag. I don't think I've really done too many wetlands apart from... Like when they put the dungeon on a uh, testing. I haven't done a lot of moonlights apart from that either. have that cool all right one more attack and then we're one eight and then i get to focus primarily on just other stuff full we'll scene beer god be an event now or like an event god And not just like a really obscure enemy that you find sometimes. Yeah, you know, I think I my chest video just did so horribly, like loot wise, because of the fact that um I had my pet. I forgot that pets just can just steal soulbound, and that's why at some point I just had like two chests that didn't drop anything. Hey, you. Yeah, you. Look, I don't have a lot of time to say this, but 99% of my viewers aren't subscribed, so why not go ahead and do it? It's a free way to support me. And you're at this point in the video, so I imagine you like something about it. I know you want to help me reach 1,000 subscribers. All right, back to your regularly scheduled program. Wow, that would have, that would just, <laughs> that would have killed just about anyone. I don't know what's been going on with this guy in chat. But uh, I think he's been trying to get someone to play with him. I really hate how they just made all things, this or all uh, modifiers, the exact same color. Like, at, at first glance... You could just decide on whether or not you wanted to do a dungeon or not based on how many greens and reds there were. But now they're just like, no, <laughs> have have all of them be gray. And I, what what was their reason for it? it? Was just like, oh, some of them were like harder or made the dungeon harder, even though. Um, they were green, so we just made all of them. <laughs> uh, we just made all of them gray. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's what it was, right? Which is, uh, yet again, another unnecessary change that uh, Decca made for no reason. Although, um, they did remove uh, more attack and uh, more health, though. Or I'm pretty sure, right? So that's uh that's nice. Yeah, now they're locked to uh the solo keys, right? I, I can live with that because you know, if you're playing doing an exalt dungeon solo, you'd probably want everything to have less health. Or not. I mean, hey. More power to you if you can do it without 
those buffs. And that's 1-8, hell yeah. Ooh, hey, upgrade. Or, yeah, I made a lot of progress in an hour, considering, you know, I'm using a controller, which is handicapping myself. I got nerfed, bro. Well, I'm nerfing myself, but still. Um. Oh, ouch. That hurt. That would have been a really funny way to die. It's just right before works. If this is an O3, then... Obviously, I'm gonna have to stay for it. It's not crashing, because you guys have seen that I've been in this one realm for the last, like, hour. They're crashing my clear, really. And by that, I mean, uh, I can't farm any more sprites. Oh, Oryx Chicken. Ap Apocalypse Feather? If I could get Apocalypse Feather, that would be cool. My friend has one, and uh, she dangles it over my head. Because uh, she knows that it is one of the my favorite items. And I just do not have one. Alright. Oryx Mark. Uh, they're spelling out the N-word in chat again. Oh man. Well, he was trying to. There we go. I got my stun in. Come on, guys. I'm the best stunner around. Hell yeah! You know we'd be popping that abyssal. Abyssal? You know we'd be popping that bit. What's going on here? Oh, there's a knight. There's a knight on the wall. Oh, that's my comfort character being hung. What does that man mean by nya? I know exactly what he means, but... I remember when you could stun him. This game gets worse every update when it comes to being an enemy. <laughs> Man, night mains can't have shit anymore. <laughs> I, I really don't care. It does... It's funny, though. Okay, buddy, can you not do this? I want to kill you. And when you do that, I can't kill you. Zero. Okay, we take that. Dragon, why not? What's Subtruth doing in my realm? Like a bad omen, the moment I saw him, I almost got ran over by a dragon. Alright, it's time to get a zero. And lol. Lol zero. They really need to change the hallucination uh, sprite sheet. Because isn't it just using the OG... Um, Yeah, isn't it just using the OG sprite sheet? Like, that you get all of, or that they, um, got all of the assets for Realm from. And by they, I mean a wild shadow. Can you go back to your... There you go. 
I'm gonna say. Just, just go back to standing right here, please. All right, we only need nine more decks, baby. They really should have just made the pot of gold drop a guaranteed coin. I mean, it's a pot of gold. Like, why wouldn't it drop a guaranteed coin? I'm not using your damn dies. You know, I gotta put Subjuf's face in the title or thumbnail. Subtruth, uh, and King Ender collab? Exa HP time. That's not an Exa HP. Ooh, hey. It's got an enchantment, so it makes it better. Two more attack. DPS shield? Dude. That guy's name's Ludinator. That's badass. Ludinator, if you see this... Cool username, dude. Penguin. I love penguins. My favorite bird. My favorite flightless bird. My favorite bird, snow owls. Smiley face. Oh shit! Candy coated. I mean, not really. You know what? I'll rock it. I'll rock it. You know, you gotta wrap it. First white bag that I can use. Dude, I don't know what they did when they made the white bag sprite, but that thing is so nice, bro. Like, damn. You can actually see the individual pixels on the shadow there. That's pretty interesting. No, the white bag. It's despawning. We could probably get a sprite world in. Oh yeah, we're we're making record time, dude. Oh. Sorry, Subtruth. I'm so glad they're moving back over to two month long seasons because it was it was so lame being like, oh wow, new season. There's some cool stuff in this. Uh, it ends in three days. Well, I guess it wouldn't be the new season if it ends in three days because they're all they've all been a month long for the last like six months or whatever but Give me Stone Sword or Dragon Soul or any of the swords, honestly. Or just a Tier 8 Flail. I'll take a Tier 8 Flail, too. Or an, I'll take an Enchanted Tier 7 Flail. Just give me something. I'm not picking that up.
Damn. All of those drops, none of them mine. I don't really need the Abyssal anymore. Owie, that hurt. Owie, that hurt more. Sky Splitter, let's fucking go. No snake eye ring yet. To be fair, I really haven't been trying to get one. Wow, that's so lazy. Sky Splitter and that guy's shots are the exact same. I'm joking. I'm joking. One, it's smart to reuse assets. Two, um, smart to reuse assets. There you go. Man, I've... I've got to remember to turn off alarms when I'm already up at this early. Ow. See, I didn't pick up the Sky Splitter, because, um... It's bad luck to pick up drop items. Uh, I would know I am the uh, founder of Legally Lucky People. Damn, everyone was just sitting out. Let's. I did not even notice that. Probably swap back to my other ring, because less wisdom is gonna hurt. Ah, oh, oh man, we were this close, bro. Ain't no one need a recomp. Bam, 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 zero. Deca servers. Let's pop those that standard shield I got. Huh. Wow, all of those had an enchantment on them. <laughs> if you guys like the video, like the video. If you like me, subscribe, and I will see you all in the next video. Goodbye.